Hi everybody, my name is Sherry. Welcome to my studio and to Catalog Kickoff Day. So if you're watching this on January 4th, the day that I posted the video, then it's the first day that these two new catalogs have gone live. Um, so I'm gonna take a quick minute before we do the tutorial today and I'm just gonna um, share a couple of things about each of the catalogs. So if you're unfamiliar with Celebration, um, we used to do this always once a year. Um, this year we're doing it twice a year, so you may feel like, oh, I, we, didn't we just do celebration? Yes, we did. Um, but now we're going to do it, um, you know, they're always switching things up a little bit. So for a while, especially I want you to pay attention because it's the normal time for celebration. So in the past, it used to be January and February. And then it was January, February, March. And then when it was January, February, March, like they would have a couple of second and third releases this year it's just January, February, and what you see is what you get. So I want you to pay attention to that. It starts January 4th and it ends February 28th. They are while supplies last. So everything in here is free, but I suggest that as you make your wish list, um, you get the things that you love the most the first at first and then um, go through them so you know you get what you want first in case they would run out. Now paper is, if anything's gonna run out, the way they've done it, um, and I'm talking to our U.S. audience, um, is these things are produced in-house in the U.S. So unless it becomes a supply issue as far as getting, because, um, you know, new world we live in, unless they can't get something to make the stamps or make the paper, then it should last. Um, as we get towards the end, then things may run out because they can't mass produce another, you know, thousands of units of something um, to make it. But everything in here is free. So I'm going to explain to you the three ways. If you got my email yesterday, then I walked you through the three different ways that you can earn things. Everything in here is free with 50 or a $100 purchase. And it does accumulate. So if your order is $300, then however you divide it up between 100 and and $50 increments and the website or I, if you want to call me or email me, I can walk you through it as well. Um, but it doesn't, you can't spend 75 and then next week spend 25 and go back and try to get that other 25. It's in an order. So um, there are stamp sets. I can open it. It's always such a relief when we can open it because we can't open them until the catalogs are live. So like this stamp set is free with 50. I haven't even used this one yet. This paper, it, this is my favorite thing in here. So I'm gonna tell you my favorite and I have accumulated quite a bit of it. So we'll be able to use it. This is free with 50. So it will tell you. Um, and because it shows other stuff, a lot of times we say everything in here is free. Just because it shows something that they used to make the card, that doesn't mean it. It means the stuff that has an order number. Um, here, this is probably my second favorite thing, and I almost used it on today's card. You're gonna see a variation. These two stamp sets are free with 50. I'm gonna use this one today. Um, so that's how you can tell these things here. This one is, if you're in the card club, this is what you can get free this month with card club. I'm gonna show you a couple of card club things. Then this, like this one is free with a $100 purchase, but this is stamps and 12 by 12 paper. So you can just go through and kind of see there's a stamp set like this one here. It's got a ton of stamps, 21 stamps. So that's free with 100. And then back here, this stamp set right here, this is a hostess special. But it's also, especially in the days of COVID, if you do an online event with your friends, if you just gather orders, or if you just have a huge wish, wish list, which a lot of you do, and you spend $300 and this is in one order, then this just gets added. Now, it does have a pop-up if you're shopping on the website and you'll need to add that. Um, but this is your, um, we call it a host gift, but it's also um, just a free, a free huge thank you if your order's over $300. So there's that. And then my very favorite part of celebration is if you join my team um, and you can read it back here and you can see these are all from everywhere. So if you join during any time you join Stampin' Up, you get to pick $125 for just $99 and there's no tax. I mean, no shipping. You pay tax, but no shipping. And then you just pick $125 of whatever you want. And I have a bunch of team perks, like all of my online classes, always free. Um, and then you can, I mean, you'll get the discount. So you buy the stuff yourself, but you get the videos always for free. We have a great Facebook book, a Facebook group, and I always post the videos on there. Um, I do art contests. I do all kinds of, we have two Facebook groups. Um, one just for the girls that are just signed up under, under me and then one for everybody in our group. 
And then three times a year, y'all have been hearing me talk about my try it class. My girls in my group actually get the supplies for that at no cost as well. So that's a perk of, I have lots of perks, but that's probably the biggest one um, because that's a 70, $75 class depending on um, the supplies for that. So three times a year, you can get that at no cost. Um, but during celebration, so through the end of February, but if you want the try it class, you're going to have to get in on it sooner while I'm um, cutting the paper for that. You can look in this catalog or in the annual catalog and pick any two stamp sets you want and just add those after you've chosen your $125. So there's that. So that celebration, this only goes through the end of February. And one of the reasons I want to point that out is like the rainbow paper, um, this Tulip paper, is it tulips? I always get that, maybe it's daffodils. <laughs> I get the, it's daffodils. These have coordinating things in here. So don't come March and think, oh, I need that rainbow paper or I need that daffodil paper, where is it? Because it's gonna be in here and it will be gone. That's kind of what happened with the penguins and stuff in the other one. So this one does go through the end of June or while supplies last, which sometimes like the dies, so, uh, and even the stamp set that I chose for my card club in, in December, it went out before we actually had Card Club. So not everybody that wanted it got it. But it, there is so much stuff in here and we will be going through it. And as I do today's card now, I can show you. So I do wanna tell you that I posted, if you saw this video that posted yesterday, I was really torn on what to do for my first online January class. So, cause I didn't know whether to use On the Horizons bundle or the Grassy Grove bundle. So what I did, because I've been torn also what to do with my online retreats, because usually those are three bundles. They're kind of a larger online class, um, but it's more retreat style. So I've opted not for this time while supply issues are still kind of a thing. We're not gonna do a retreat. So this is kind of a mini retreat, and you can choose to do both of the, the stamp set bundles, or you can just choose one. So it's a, kind of like a little mini retreat. If you do choose both, then you also get a celebration set. So information for that has posted. That way I didn't have to decide, and you can decide if you like one more than the other, but they both work really well with the paper. If you do do both, you get the celebration um, choices for free, and you also get this pack of paper for free. And then my January card club, um, we'll be using this paper, or this ribbon, the embellishments that I'm using today, and then this stamp set. So all of these videos are up. Now, I don't know the names of anything hardly that I'm using today. Well, I do know some of them. The stamps are up there. So I have this pulled out because now I can open it. It's always hard when I can't open the catalog, especially at Christmas. So I'm going to show you a bunch of different things. I'm going to use the Gentle Waves, and I'm just going to kind of walk you through it first. We have a couple of new background stamps. This is one. I really, really, really liked this one. I think, um, okay, I'm done with winter. If you follow my channel, you know I, we have a pool, and I, work, I like to work from outside. And now that Christmas is over, I'm done with winter. It's really cold here today, and I just want to go outside, and I just want to work in my outside. outside. But it's like 22 degrees, so I'm not going to... Fahrenheit if you're watching from the South Pacific or any place else that does not do Fahrenheit. So I have chosen this fun little kind of um, retro kind of card. I'm going to go with Pool Party, Coastal Cabana, and Bermuda Bay. So always start with your lightest color, which is Pool Party. Um, and you don't have to be super care careful with this because we're going light color. So if the next one touches, it's not going to ruin the pad. And I'm just going to kind of ombre this. So start with pool party. And the nice thing is it doesn't even really matter if you miss. Pool party is a fun color. It's kind of green, kind of blue. Kind of like a pool that I, I can get in the pool. Our pool is heated, so we can get in it year round. But I can't work outside. Most certainly work outside while I'm wet right now. There's no appeal to working on the porch when it's freezing cold. So this is Coastal Cabana. I'm gonna kind of do the mid part of that in Coastal Cabana. And then I'm gonna grab the Bermuda Bay and have this be the bottom. This is a super fun stamp set and we have a new C set, which I also have. I have not even inked it. I have not taken the dies out. I've done nothing with it. But it will go perfectly with this. I just have far too many sets and not enough time because I'm working on Try It and then I took time off. I don't know why I bought so much stuff just so it could sit there and stare me in the face and I wouldn't have time to use it. Now I have just taken, I'm using the Stamparatus just because 
I think it's easier when you use a block. And when I do a stamparatus um, and a background stamp, I always just line it up to the top line here and kind of over with the Stampin' Up. And it does, the background stamp is bigger than a four by five and a quarter sheet of cardstock, and I just have a little bit of adhesive. So now when you shut it, just make sure it's gonna cover it and everything is on there. So just press down. And the nice thing is, if I miss anywhere, I can do it again. Isn't that pretty? So you can see right there is not great, right up here is not great. Just do it again. And if it's because I didn't ink it, that's good. That's not great there, but I'm gonna, the middle of my card's gonna be covered up, so I'm not super worried about it. And then I can trim this down because this is a little bit bigger than what I need. So there, isn't that just really, really pretty? And doesn't it make you wanna go to the beach or out to the pool? I didn't realize that, um, I think that's probably where my head was when I did this. So pull that off and just move that aside. I'll trim that down. You don't need to see me. I'm just gonna trim that little inch off. So now this is a, the free celebration set, driving by. So I pulled out the combi van, the little VW van. I don't know, sometimes I'm like, uh, I said it both ways. So I'm not sure how we say it. Is it I think combi van was a dream. <laughs> but my daughter's always kind of wanted one of these in kind of mint green, but we don't have a mint blend. <laughs> so that's why it's not mint. So I just stamped it, and this is in shimmery, shimmery white cardstock, which is kind of a vanilla tone. So I'm gonna let this sit and just dry for just a second, and I'm going to show you the Mother of Pearl cardstock. I have a big piece of it here, in case you haven't seen it yet. It is so pretty, and it goes with, it's a little, got a little scratch in it. It goes with, um, the, like the crane. I don't remember what the name of the suite is. It's got cranes in it. Uh, it's kind of an oriental looking suite, but I've already cut that down. I just wanted to just do the big one. So I have pulled out just a frame from the annual catalog. I'll put the, now that I can put the shopping things on my blog, I'll put which one this is on there. But this is, anyone would work. Just, you just want a little frame of this. So I'm just gonna put this on here. Also, Mother of Pearl, it kind of has that beachy feel to it. So I'm just gonna run the frame through first. And then I've pulled out one of the mini embossing folders. So it's called um, Stripes and Splatters. It's a 3D embossing folder. I've used the stripes on another card. I don't know when I used it, but I do know that I have used this on one of my tutorials. So if you could go back in December, it would have been in December, maybe the end of November. Um, but this one, I'm gonna use the stripes and splatters because look, yeah, it looks like water. At first I went over, I didn't even remember that we had this because it's been a minute. When uh, It's weird, you stop stamping and I probably didn't stamp for about three weeks in a row. But see, it's super fun. You just lay that in there and I'm gonna get a splatter. But because this stuff was all brand new and because I didn't stamp at all, um, like I seriously don't remember what was over there. So I went over to get the one that kind of looks like waves and that's what I was gonna use on here. And then I happened to see this one and I'm like, no, it's new and it's perfect. So look how much fun. And you can already see that it's gonna be splattered, but on this mother of pearl paper, it's just super fun. And it's kind of that fun, um, because this is not a serious card by any stretch of the imagination when you put a, a van on it. So now we have this, and I'm sure it's dried enough now that I can color it. I don't feel like I colored hardly any, any in December. Like Christmas cards and blends really aren't something that I do together because if you're mass producing something, blends aren't something you really wanna do unless you have one special card. I think maybe I did, mm, no, I was thinking maybe I did the angels with blends, but maybe I did those with painting them because you can paint faster than you can color with blends. So this is dark and light smoky slate. And then I have dark and light Bermuda Bay and then I have um, dark and light pool party. So I think I said that we didn't have a mint um, blend, we do have mint. It was Coastal Cabana and Mint. Like, I didn't feel like I could get 
could get Carissa's the color of combi van that she wants. Because when we go to Australia, these are just, you know, on the beach. And she's always just wanted one. So I've got that colored. Uh, and I did that and I'm going to let that sit for a minute and that's in the two shades of the smoky slate. Now I'm going to go to my Bermuda Bay. I'm going to start with the dark. And I'm just going to, these different panels, I'm just going to add a little bit of dark to each panel. I didn't want to add more color. Like I, the smoky slate is already another color, but I don't want this to be like colored. So I wanted to stick to the color combination that I have working on the background. So I'm working with what I got and we're gonna make this work. Now I'm gonna do the light and this will bleed so you don't want it to go any bigger. Like I'm not going out to the edge. I am gonna to have to hand trim it. We don't have a die obviously for the free, the free little set. So if it does bleed and you hand trim something, at least you can trim that out. But I don't want it to bleed too much and I don't want it to bleed up into my windows. So this first time I'm doing it, it's kind of just... So my husband, this, <laughs> it's not, it's dry heat here, right? Because I have my furnace going. But my husband um, like rigged this thing up for us. So when we do our laundry, it feeds the the dryer back into the house and it steams up all the windows and it gets incredibly muggy in here. And so, so I did laundry and so that's the reason they had to wait for this to dry. Otherwise it's gonna bleed all over the place. So this is just a little tip. This is my dark pool party and I'm gonna color it twice to get kind of the darkest of the pool party that I can right here. Because normally probably if I was gonna do this, I might do that in one of our lighter yellows inside the windows. Um, and probably the little light down here, but I don't want yellow on this card. So there's my dark pool party. Now I'm gonna take the brush tip of my light pool party and just barely brush over that. So it gives kind of the sky through um, and it just kept the color combination and so it's dark and light. So we still have two colors, but I didn't have to add another. Now I'm gonna go back over here and add one more little, cause you know, you can layer the blends so even though I'm just working with the two colors of the greens or blues, I never know. Are these greens or are they blue? Um, because I'm going to layer the colors. It's going to be enough color. So I'll finish doing that. I'm going to do the same thing with the smoky slate. I'm going to layer the, the um, wheels so they'll be a little bit darker. And then when I do the hubcaps just once, they'll be a little bit lighter. And then I'll just fast forward so you can see it done. Okay, so I've colored it and then I just hand trimmed it out. But you can see now it's got the different shading and it's just those colors. So you don't have to, you don't have to take forever. Now I'm going to, I didn't want any of these sayings. They're cute. Driving by to say hi. You've got style all thanks. But I wanted to show you something new. And I wanted to remind you, this is the stamp set that goes with the paper that you can get free. So that way I could remind you that if you love the paper, you don't have to get the stamp set now because it'll be around. But um, this is Rainbow of Happiness. It's a real fun bundle, and I do have a card that I did with it. I think that it probably, um, because I did that kind of double thing with my class, I'm thinking for February we might do the daffodils and the rainbows with the free paper. So if you do my classes, and there won't be a retreat, so don't feel like you have to save your money for the retreat. You can just do those two and then pick the ones that you like. So I just pulled out the You Make Me Happy because this kind of has that whole Partridge Family thing going for it, doesn't it? So now we have the You Make Me Happy. So when you go to the catalog, there's a couple of other things that you can notice. Back here in the back, it will tell you stuff that we have um, that kept on from the last catalog. When you go here, it will tell you these things stayed from the previous catalog. But if you go to my website to sherry.stampinup.net, then if there was something that you loved from the last catalog, like the black gingham ribbon, it stayed. So you can search for something um, and you'll be able to pull it up and then that will tell you if it stayed. And I also wanted, while I have this back out, I will tell you my thank you gifts for January. So every month I do thank you gifts. You use the host code when you shop on my website and then in the following month, I try to do it like towards the end, the beginning of the second week. So like the end of the first, the beginning of the second, usually 
by the time you get it, I'm sure it's like middle to end of the second week with the postage. Um, so you buy from my website, you put in that host code, and then there's thank you gifts. So every month I kind of vary the amount. So this month at $35, you get, uh, I knew what it was. I have a little pop-up thing at, so I will, if you're on my email, you'll see it. At $50, you get my VIP video projects. Now for those, if you spend anything with me every month, when I send the thank you emails to let you know that your gifts are on the way, there's two projects and only people who purchase from me get to see those two projects. So there, I call them my VIP videos. They're only for people on my team and people who purchase from me. So if you spend $50, then you get the supply so you can follow along with me. Um, you don't need stamps. They just put together real simply. You can add greetings or something to them if you want. Um, sometimes I might use like flowers and you just, because everybody has a flower stamp, you can just add what you have. So at $50, you get that. And remember at $50, Stampin' Up's giving you a free thing. And then at $175, you get the sea glass embellishments. I'm trying to remember. Oh, you get the hexagons. It's a little hexagon embellishments. Uh, you would think that I could remember because I just made that um, little thing for my email. Um, at $225, then you get the supplies for both of my VIP videos. So they accumulate. And the nice thing with these, and like Stampin' Up, I can go back and I add them up. So if you place a $100 or a $100 order um, during the catalog kickoff, and then after a couple of weeks, you have um, some more and you place another 75 and that gets you to the 175, then um, you get all of that. Now it doesn't count if you're in card club, that doesn't count. Or if you do the class, that doesn't count because like I use that money for the free things for that. So if you're in VIP, um, I mean, if you're in my card club, it's envelopes. I just always get free envelopes because envelopes are included in Card Club. With the um, upcoming class, the free paper is what I'm going to use for that. So this host code, when you purchase online, gets you these free gifts. But if you purchase during my catalog kickoff, if you spend $75 in addition to the other stuff, you're going to get eight free hand stamped cards because I am overflowing in all of these cards. If you could see to my left, I probably have 500 cards, no joke, of things that I have made because I've made a lot of videos. I've made a lot of things in classes. Sometimes I make something and I make it four times. So you're going to get eight of my hand stamped cards. Most of them have been featured on my YouTube channel. Um, so you'll get those. And if you spend 125 in addition to the other levels, then you're going to get the evergreen window pane ribbon. So I wanted to let you know that. So the one gifts, the, the first level all through January, the other ones are just from um, this month. So I'm going to take this. This was my favorite. Well, I just knocked my catalog off and scared myself. Nothing like getting your heart going, huh? Hope I didn't scare you <laughs> in the video. So I'm just going to tie this over here. I haven't even had very much caffeine today. I just had an herbal tea because I feel like I have so much to do that I really didn't need any more caffeine and I didn't want to talk any faster than I knew I'd be talking because I knew this would be a long video. So I was going to try to talk fast enough that we can get through it. But I didn't want to do two. I wanted to show you a project and also show you, tell you all about the celebration and the new catalog. When they do, when we do two new catalogs and all the free stuff. And that's a really long piece of ribbon there, Sherry. So all of you that um, die when I have to throw these bits away, don't look, look away. There we go. That's better. Those are almost long enough you can save. I'm gonna save those and use them for something else. So isn't that cute? It's a great color combination. And imagine if you have like the old whale punch or something, This isn't that background just fun? So I have a piece of Coastal Cabana cardstock. That's gonna be my back. I should do some kind of a drawing for those of you that stick out this whole video. Say some kind of a code word. Sometimes I tell you to make sure that you um, put the adhesive where that ribbon's gonna be, but this ribbon doesn't need that because I've tied it on the whole thing. So put that on there. And then here's our fun little panel here. I'm just gonna add a couple of pieces of adhesive. And then I'm gonna slide this through here. Isn't it that you make me happy? Doesn't it? Who else liked the Partridge family back in the day? I don't remember the song. I don't want to get the song stuck in my head, so I'm intentionally trying to not remember the songs. So I'm just 
gonna stick this down here. And then for the embellishments on this, I am going to go, I want my ribbon to go this direction. So if you want your ribbon to go a different way, you just retie your ribbon. So this time I'm gonna tie it this direction. I'll kind of fill up my card over here. Let's see, all I have to do is tie it that, that way. Now for these, I'm gonna use the classic matte dot. <coughs> Excuse me, if you're in card club, Pretty sure this is what we're getting in Card Club. I don't know. Yep, I can see the card. This is what comes in Card Club this month. Card Club is super fun. It's my most inexpensive um, thing. It's a monthly subscription. These come in, it's the same color scheme. See, I'm still not adding anything. It has the black, the gray, and the vanilla. But Card Club, you just sign up once and PayPal manages it through their subscription service. I'm gonna kind of do the ombre with that. And then you get materials um, and you make six cards with me every month. And we're getting ready for our Zoom. We Zoom once a quarter. So how cute is that? Isn't that fun? Doesn't it? Um, can we just say we're done with winter? Those of you that live someplace warm. So here's the deal. I've lived places where it's fairly warm year round. I do like it to be, I do like my seasons. I love fall. Um, I love when spring comes and you get to see it turn green. But you know, the stretch, and I know all of you Midwest girls, if you're not gonna be out enjoying the snow, then it's just cold. So there you go. Make sure you're on my email list. I'd love to have you join my team. If you have any questions at all, um, Stampin' Up! is a great, obviously I've been doing it for almost 30 years. Um, it's a great, it's a great group of people to be involved with. Um, super, no pressure ever, ever, ever. Of, Tons of my team just do it for the discount. You are totally welcome to just do it for the discount and to get the free videos. I mean, if that's what you want to do it for, you are welcome to do it for that. If you want to do it and um, make a second income, make your full-time income like I do, you can do it for that too. So that's what I have for you today. Head over to my website and get your first order in and get all your freebies. Have a great one. Bye.